hello guys and welcome to my channel this is savage yt guys and guys i have to say that eh, if you are new to my channel i suggest you go ahead and there smash the subscribe button like and share this video and if you have any question relating to any bookmarker all you have to do is just for you to leave it at the comment box below as we look forward to answering to every single bit of your question in any sports bookmarker guy and so guys without no further ado let's jump right in on today's uh, tutorial and uh, prediction guys on today's analytics tutorial prediction and so guys today we'll be answering the question of uh, one of our subscribers asking to give him a vivid understanding of what multi-score and multi-goals is or the difference as well so guys first of all we'll be discussing about a uh, multi goals just as the name implies guys multi goals are series or range of number of goals that will be scored in a regular 90 minute match from both teams that is multi goals the numbers of goals that will be scored in a regular 90 minutes match from both teams let me show you what a multi score looks like this is what a multi sorry multi goals looks like so for example we are under the match between rayo vallecano against the fc barcelona and we are saying that the numbers of goals that will be scored in this game will not exceed uh, one to three numbers of goals and that is what barcelona has played in their last uh, two matches winning home and away on a 2-1 outcomes so we expect this match to not to end on a 2-1 outcome. We expect Barcelona to win this game on a 1-0 or a 2-0 or eventually a 1-1 outcome, guys. So we are going with to say that the total numbers of goals that will be scored in this very game is not going to exceed more than 1-3 to three goals. By 1-3 to three goals, we means that it's either Barcelona win by 0-2. If Barcelona are able to win by a 0-2, it is a win. If they are able to win by a 0-3, it is a win. If they are able to win by a 0-1, it is as well a win. If the match ends in a 0-0 outcome, it is a loss because there was no goal that, would, that was scored in that match, which is this. No goal scored in that very game. And that is the option. So, that is what we mean by a multi goals guys so your option varies you have the one of a one to four goals two to three goals one to six goals two to five goals and guys another thing that you need to know about this multi goals it comes in different or in various options we have multi goals which is a goal that will be scored from both teams team a and team b playing against each other in a regular football match of 90 minutes you can be able to predict the numbers of goals that is going to come, the multiple goals that is going to come in that match. And once again, we have what we call the home multi goals, guys. The home multi goals. By home multi goals, we mean the numbers of goals that will be scored by the home side, the home team. How many goals will they score? Now, we are not talking about eh, the both teams. We are talking about just the home team alone. The numbers of goals that they are going to score in a regular 90 minutes of a football gameplay as well just as what we explained about the home side that is also what is applicable in the away side the numbers of goals that would be scored by only the away side in the regular 90 minutes of gameplay it can be one to two goals by one to two goals you know that eh? it is the goal that they are going to score will not exceed will not be more than two goals it will not be more than two goals. It's either it is between two or one. But a goal must be scored in that game. When there is no goal, then your bets do not count. If It means that no goal. When there is no goal in that match, a away team, which is Barcelona, were, able, were unable to score a goal, then it is a no-goal, multi-goal outcome. But when they are able to score one goal, but not more than two goals, then it's a, the goal now ranges from one to two outcome. So that is that. So guys, with this explanation, I guess you should just go ahead and there, smash that subscribe button, guys. Smash the subscribe button, like and share this video, guys. And let's continue with uh, multi-goals as well. Now we have uh, 
the first half multi goal and the second half a multi goal. By first half multi goal, we mean the numbers of goals that would be scored in the range of uh, in a regular half time match of 45 minutes from both teams in a regular half time whistle of a regular match of 45 minutes from both teams so when we are talking about first half multi goals we mean that uh, in during the first half we expect them to score at least one to two goals or one to three goals or one to or two to three goals in that very outcome or as well we can say that uh, during the first half gameplay there won't be no goal no goal will be scored in that very outcome the match is gonna end on a zero zero outcome in the first half that is a first half multi goals and when we talk about second half multi goals guys it is just as we explain the first half multi goals the numbers of goals that would be scored in a regular time of after half time from 46 minutes of the gameplay to the 90th minute of the gameplay the moment the match was kicked off in the second half to the moment the match was there uh, the whistle was blown to the end of a uh, first second half that is a uh, second half a uh, multi goals uh, option that is it so now let's talk about uh well guys i believe you understand what a uh, multi goals uh, outcome is home multi goals, away multi goals, first half multi goals, and then second half multi goals. If you understand this and you really enjoy that, don't forget to smash the subscribe button, like, and then please share this video. So, guys, let's go on. Let's write on on a multi score, guys. Just as the name implies, multi score. From the word score, it means what? Correct score. It is a correct score prediction or a correct score option. It is a correct score prediction or a correct score option. But because of the fact that you are now giving a multiples of option to select what will be the score line of a regular football match, it is now called a multi-score option. So, guys, just as the name implies, multi score option, it is simply what? A kind of bookmarker option whereby a punter, a wager, or a better is expected to make a selection which varies or gives him the probability of making multiples of a correct score option to his favorite choice of a pick for example a match that will be played between uh manchester city and uh okay let's continue with this rayo valacano against the uh, fc barcelona now on a good understanding state we expect uh, barcelona to win this game either by a zero one outcome or a zero two outcome or a zero three outcome which we know that uh we are skeptic doubtful about barcelona scoring three goals in that match but we definitely know that they will score a goal they have every likelihood they they are as in they are the favorite team to score right Valcano are more or less the underdogs but barcelona are the favorite team to score or to win this very game but now we are not going with a uh, one correct score option to say that uh, barcelona are going to win that game on a barcelona will win uh, Rayo Valcano 0 2. Yes, that will be the scoreline of the game. No. But at this point, you have been given the chances or the option of making a multiple uh, selection of a scoreline. So we say that uh, the match is going to end on a 0 1 or 0 2 or a 0 3, but all in the favor of a Barcelona. So that is what a multi score is. So depending on uh, your choice of a. Uh, uh, peak in that very event that will determine your selection here so unlike uh, uh what would i call it um Arsenal who played against uh, uh against the uh, aston villa during the weekend Arsenal were able to win that game on a 2-0 outcome so if you were able to make your multiple choice of a scoreline 
then you can say that Arsenal are going to win that game on a 0-1 or a 0-2 or a 0-3, which they end up winning that game on a 0-2 outcome. And again, you talk about the likes of uh, Mas- uh, Madrid, who won their game on a 1-0 or 2-0 or 3-0 outcome. Or you talk about Liverpool, who won their game on a 1-0, 2-0. Uh-huh. But when you talk about other home, I'm going to explain what an order is on our next video. When we talk about order in a football match, I will explain to you what an order is in a football gameplay. So guys, that is it. That is all you need to understand between a multi-score and multi-goal. But guys, if you are still with us on this very tutorial and you are enjoying every single bit of our tutorial, I suggest you go ahead and smash the subscribe button. Give us some like. Push that subscribe button. Don't forget to turn on your notification bell if you want to be part of this journey guys so the difference the basic difference between multi-score and multi-goal is that a multi-goals involves uh, the total numbers of goals that would be scored in a regular 90 minutes gameplay of every match from both teams why multi-score is a multi-selection of a correct score or the outcome of a gameplay in a regular 90 minutes match that is the difference between a multi score and the multi goals so guys for that being said guys let's jump in on our today's selection but uh, i have to say that uh, today's selection is just going to be a one bed sleep but if you want to be part of a more bed sleep guys i suggest you join us on our, our telegram channel which uh, i will be leaving the link in my description i'll be leaving the link in my description and so guys you just have to be part of it and uh, yesterday's uh, prediction we also had a uh, only one better uh, sleep on our telegram channel but uh, we really want that game and that's just uh, a three odd outcome so guys if you want to be part of this journey all you have to do is just for you to join us through the description on this video so guys if you enjoyed this video i suggest you go ahead and there smash the subscribe button like and share this video as i look forward to seeing you on our next video thanks and uh, peace